Investec Wealth and Investments Chief Investment Strategist Chris Halsworth has cautioned that the decision to maintain the repo rate at the July meeting possesses a risk as excessively tight monetary policy could potentially lead the economy into a recession. Halsworth believes that the choice to keep interest rates unchanged was risky, especially considering the improving inflation outlook and the market's anticipation of multiple rate cuts in the next year. According to the economic theory, if the stringent monetary policy aimed at curbing inflation is taken too far, it could drive ag aggregate demand so low that a recession may ensue. Economics professor Walter Krichel provides insights on the matter. Currently, the repo rate is what economists call restrictive. But as we get the inflation rate closer to 4.5%, the question is whether the Reserve Bank has to keep their foot on the brake or can they afford to ease off? They need to get the number of cuts and the timing of rate cuts right to keep inflation at the target and not restrict economic activity further. This is where some analysts argue that inflation is falling faster than the Reserve Bank predicts and that the upside risks of a resurgence of inflation are smaller than the Reserve Bank thinks. It's difficult to judge this debate since regular consumers know little about the assumptions of these forecasting models. We do know that the stakes are high. Keeping the repo too high for too long will hurt what is left of consumer spending and the positive sentiment associated with the government of national unity. We need a bit more guidance from the Reserve Bank about for how long we still need to keep our belts tightened. Just knowing that the end is in sight will help a lot.